And it don't matter from where you come There's nothing like being around Palmerston Okay, we're at Mill and Gimby. This place is jumping. This is Norella Anderson from Environ Bank. And this is Ian Cannon from Clean Up Australia. Ian, in your wildest dreams when you first started this, did you think it would ever work like this? No, it's a great reward to be here today. Obviously, this is a huge success. We've obviously found the gizmos that make it fun for the kids as well. Absolutely. Don't they love the, the can-eating machine? Norella Anderson, EnviroBank's your company. We started about 12 months ago in Darwin and Palmerston, but did you think this would happen? Oh, this was always the plan, Wayne, and we're so excited to be here today. But you see, that the whole community is getting behind cash for containers, and we're so excited that we've been able to deliver the program. All these bottles came from the clean-up day here at Mill and Gimby down on the beach today. It's just a great news story to see all the litter that was down there turning into dollars and spending money for these guys. Michael Nemerich is the operations manager of the Arnhem Land Progress Aboriginal Corporation at Mill and Gimby here today. It's unbelievable, isn't it, mate? They have gone nuts. You know, this is the first opportunity they've actually had of getting the money that they uh, are entitled to from the tables. And the place looks an absolute picture. There's no bottles or cans any place. No, I think they've uh, even started raiding people's houses and pouring them out themselves. <laughs> so what a great story this is. And here's the end. The kids have been out, they've collected the cans and bottles, they've put it through the reverse vending machine, and now comes the reward. With the tokens, the kids are able to come into the store. Bingo! How good is that, kids? Good? Yeah, it's fantastic. <laughs>